Hey guys, it's your girl Gabby, and I'm back with another makeup tutorial today. Okay, so first, of course, we're going to prime the skin with, of course, my um, Maybelline Master Prime Color Corrector. Okay, so we're gonna put some on my hand, just a little dot. Well, it's like a I don't really know what size this is. Not a little dot, but like a pretty big dot. There's a hair on my hand and I can't get it off. Okay, rub that around. Do y'all ever put primer on your skin and then like afterwards it feels really oily? That happens to me a lot. Okay, now we're done with this. So we're going to move on to, well, we're gonna let this dry first. So I guess we'll do a little questionnaire. What is y'all's favorite color? Comment down below and tell me. Okay, is that enough? We'll put some more. Okay. See, I've got much better lighting today. beauty blender which I've already wet so we're going to take the flat side and we're going to tap into the foundation and we're going to put it all over the face of course it's supposed to be total coverage but I don't use as much as I should redness no redness we're gonna need to use some more foundation okay one second I need more foundation just enough to do the forehead and the rest of my face tap tap oh that's a lot okay Okay, use the rest of this for my forehead. Make sure this is blended, okay? Because I don't have a mirror. By the way, do y'all like my shirt? I got it from Kato's, I believe, and it's like my favorite shirt ever. Do you like Nikki does and cover up the lips? <laughs> I'll, I don't really cover mine up like all the way. I just put a little bit on. Okay, I think we're done with foundation. Smooth that out of my hand. Okay, done with foundation. Now we're going to go in with concealer. Again, I'm using Dream Brightening Creamy Concealer. I don't know if you can see that. Okay, so I'm going to make a triangle um, underneath my eye. Ooh, there's another hair. What? Go away. It's like wrapped up around the concealer. Okay, let's try that again. As you can see, there's hardly any on my face because I like natural makeup, so. Okay. Okay, now I still have some dark circles under my eye, but, under my eye, <laughs> my eyes, um, but, I mean, I can never cover them up all the way, so, that's that. Okay, next we're going to go in with some blush, and my brushes are in the other room. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> I'm going to go in with this brush again, this one right here, it's 
angled, so I'm using it for blush. And I'm going to go in with my Avon blush today. See, I don't know if you can see this. It says Avon now. Yeah, there we go. And then it's a very light shade, but it's very pigmented, so I'm gonna take off this stupid little brush because I never use it. Okay, so you're gonna tap about four times and you're going to smear that all over the cheek, up into the temples. See, blush, no blush. Okay, now we're going to, oh, I forgot to put the brush, the so-called brush, back into the blush. Okay, so now that we're finished with um, the blush, we're going to go in with the Beauty Blender again, and we're going to do, if I can find it. Ugh, where it at, though? Seriously, though, where, where is it? Oh, here we go. <laughs> okay, Bloom Glotion, again. There we go. Um, and we're going to put a little bit on the, if I can open it, on the Beauty Blender. A little dot like we did yesterday. Okay, little dot, put that down. Then we're going to go tap, tap, tap. I think you can see it better today. Yeah, with this natural lighting, it's a whole lot better. There we go, see, shiny, no shine. Well, I mean, there's a little shine, but it's because I have oily skin. And I can't find a foundation that helps with that, so. Okay, so we're gonna go in with another little dot. Okay, tap, tap, tap. And smear that all around. Well, not smear it, like dab it in. Now we're going to put a little bit on the tip of the beauty blender and we're going to do the nose. And you're going to use about half as much as you did for the cheeks, so barely any on the tip. And you're going to tap, tap, tap. Okay. So it's a little shiny, but... That's okay, because that's what we want. We want some shiny highlight. But this just adds like a like a pre-highlight, so it sticks better to the cheeks, because I have cheap highlighter, so. Okay, so now we're going to go in with the eyes. And I need to move all these brushes off of my, off of my um, palettes. Okay. We're going to do the Silent Night Bella palette today. See? And we're going to, oh, have y'all noticed my new nails? See, they're like teal and they're shorter, but I kind of like them better longer. So I'm kind of disappointed. Oh, and the lady who did them like cut my fingers. I don't know if you can see that. They're really red. Okay. So we're gonna go in with my No Name brush, <laughs> which we got from Amazon, I think. It's like a gradual slope to it. Okay, so since I primed my eyes earlier with concealer, I don't know if you noticed that, but I did. <laughs> and um, we're going to go with the transition shade, of course, because we need to warm that puppy out. Okay, not need to, need to not choose the shiny one. This is the shiny one, and this one I'm gonna be, oh, can you see it? This one I'm gonna be um, using for the transition shade. It's a matte finish. Okay, now we've got that on. It put a little color into the eyes, not very much though. Okay, so now that we have that on, we're going to go in with this um, like taupe color right here. Okay, just two taps. Smear into the creases. Okay. 
Okay. Tap, tap. Okie dokie. Now that we have that on the eyes, it's like a very gradual, um, like shift to a lighter color. And so now we're going, oop, hold on, this one's not going out very well. So now we're going to go in with um, a little bit of a darker shade. We're going to go into this brown right here. I hope you can't see it right here. Okay. We're going to tap into that once. And we're going to put that on the lid on the corner. Okay, tap once. Lid. we've got that on the lid we're going to go in with a shiny shade and we're going to be using a different brush so we're going to be using the one that has like the sharper slope to it because we is going to well first we're going to blend it upwards to the eyebrow somewhat see there we go now we're going to do it with this side. I don't know if this side is going as well. This is just an attempt. I've never done this before. So, yeah. So we're going to keep blending this upwards. Hopefully it comes out okay. <laughs> okay. I think it looks pretty good actually. Y'all comment down below though and tell me if it looks horrible. Okay, so now that we've got that on the the lid or the whatever you call this part of your eye. I'm going to blow this one out a little bit more. Okay. Now we're going to be going in with that shiny shade right here. And we're going to tap into oh, I think that's on my shirt. Okay, we're going to be um, tapping into that and we're going to put it on the inner corner of the lid. Okay. Okay, now we're going to go in with a shiny shimmery shade, which I'm going to get out of the B35D palette. So I'm going to be going in with this golden shade right here, right here. And we're going to put that on the inner corner. We might put a little bit more on the other eye too. Okay. Yeah, a little bit more on the side. And my headband's falling off. That's great. Okay, now we're going to go in with this white shade right here. And we're going to put that on the inner part of the lid. Okay, do the other eye. And I'm doing all this without a mirror, so props to me. I think we need a little more on that eye. Okay. So now we've got our natural makeup again our eye makeup I mean and we're going to go in with the highlighter it's loud sorry okay I'm using a different brush for highlighter today I'm gonna to be using this one it's um, just like a little little poof and I'm going to be doing my highlighter with it okay which highlighter do I want to use I think I'm going to be using my other e.l.f. My other e.l.f. If I can find it. Come on, baby. Come on. 
What are you? I have so many things in this bag. It's not even funny. Ha. At the very bottom, I found it. Okay. Ooh. Baby, you just broke. <sighs> Fix that right up. Okay. So we're gonna get all into this right here. It's not coming off. Hello? This is why I don't buy elf stuff. Elf makeup. Yeah, there we go. Go up some. Need to blend that down some. Okay. Dip, 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 dip. My nose is running because I'm always sick. Now it's a subtle highlight, which I like, except I'm getting some BH ones in this week, and I don't know when they'll be in. We're gonna go in with this dark shade for the under eyes, right here. Okay. Okay, so if you can see, it's like light to dark and then dark underneath. Mm, should I add this green shade? This one right here? I think I am. I'm gonna spice it up a little bit today. Okay, it's like an army green color. I'm gonna put it right here. Yeah, that's pretty. Okay. I'm so scatterbrained, it's not even funny. Okay, now I'm going to blend this out. Ugh, there's a hair. Where's it at? Okay, I know I felt the hair. Okay, blend this one out. Where are you at? There we go. Oh, blend it upwards too. Okay. Now we've got that on. I don't have any eye, they're coming in this week, but I don't have any eyebrow um, pencils or whatever, so I'm gonna start doing that this next week. But um, for right now, I'm just gonna leave them ugly puppies alone. They're so ugly. I have a unibrow, but I pluck it so you can't really tell. Except for now, I just gave it away. So, okay. Um, so we've got all that done. We need to do. We need to curl the eyelashes, which I didn't do yesterday. And then we're gonna put on mascara and then lipstick, and we'll be done. Now that we've got that done, we're going to do mascara, which I can't find. Again, <sighs> I need a different bag or just like set it all up on the floor because where I am on the floor. One second. Ha, I found it. Okay, again, we're using the Lash, la, 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 lash Sensational by Maybelline my favorite mascara. I don't put very much mascara on because I don't like my eyelashes to look like spider legs. Okay, you can see this side compared to this side. This one you can tell doesn't have mascara on.
and then on the bottom a little bit more on the side okay now the mascara is done and we're going to do some lipstick okay let's see what shade look at all my lipsticks I have and oh well there's glitter there but I have an obsession I don't know if you can see <sighs> I think we're going to do a nude lip today so now I don't have any like plain nude where is that thing at? plain nude lipstick so I'm going to be using some of this it's my concealer don't hate me okay now that I've got that on, I'm going to go in with a lip gloss, and it's a very shiny lip gloss, so if I can open it, my hands are too sweaty. Let me try it with my pants. Open, dang it. <laughs> Minor technical difficulties. Okay, now that I got that out, okay, so we're going to, it's by BH by the way, BH Cosmetics. And it's like a nude color. I do that so I guess off the lipstick uh, that's like on the inside of your mouth. Okay. Uh, I'll be back in one second and we can see the final look. Okie dokie. Here we go. Final look. My lipstick is so patchy, but I didn't have a new lipstick, so I just, you know, dealt with what I had. Okay, leave a comment down below if you really like this look and if you loved my tutorial. Subscribe to my channel if you get a chance and ring that notification bell. Have a good day, y'all. Bye bye.